Hey, rise and shine, let's do a blues scale in the key of C. Cool, man. So I'm down here on the uh, first fret of the sixth string, the F. Then I go up to F sharp and G, three in a row. Then the uh, fifth string be first fret, first fret, A sharp to C. That's pretty easy. So it's a one, two, three, one, three. Then you can uh, cross over to this D sharp. Then there's another F. Now we're going to start uh, working our way up the neck. F, F sharp, G, three in a row. Three, four, five for frets. So we've now uh, uh, shifted positions a little bit here. However you want to do those three, just as long as you land with like pinky or ring at the fifth fret. Then you're ready for this uh, A sharp C at the uh, third string, third fret to fifth fret. Now it gets kind of fun. You got this uh, D sharp on the second string, fourth fret. D sharp up to F and F sharp on the second string. So that's going to be four, six, and seven for frets. Then you got your fifth interval on the uh, first string, third fret, the G. You can kind of play with that clashing quality. That's what makes it a blues scale, that flatted fifth, second string, seventh fret, F sharp. Then you get over to the G on the first string, third fret, take it up to sixth fret, which is A sharp, and take that up to C, which is eighth fret, first string. If you want to get a chord on that 5, the G, you can make a G7 triad, like a G, B, F. Maybe add a G string. That's the 5 chord. Then you can take it home to the, like a cool C7 with the G bass note, which is like G, E. A sharp for resolution. One more time.
pretty cool. Let me know if you need a PDF, I can make one.